हेलो एंड वेलकम टू श्रीदेवी क्लासेस यूट्यूब चैनल वेर वी इनकल्केट इंटरेस्ट एंड कॉन्फिडेंस इन साइंस एंड इंजीनियरिंग सब्जेक्ट्स टुडे इन आवर प्लेलिस्ट इलेक्ट्रिकल एस्टिमेशन एंड कॉस्टिंग विल अंडरस्टैंड द डेफिनेशन ऑफ इलेक्ट्रिकल एस्टिमेशन एंड डिस्कस द पर्पज ऑफ इलेक्ट्रिकल एस्टिमेशन दैट विल नरेट द ऑब्जेक्टिव एंड इम्पोर्टेंस ऑफ इलेक्ट्रिकल एस्टिमेशन लेट्स स्टार्ट whether a project is a civil construction or an electrical installation costing is the process of estimating the cost of that project before it is completed now in costing process we have to made estimation of different items which may be involved in project execution not only the description of those items is planned but what quantity will be used in project execution and what is the unit price of those items that is also obtained now costing becomes simple just we multiply item cost with quantity and sum up the entire items so we can say the accumulation of detail of required material and workmanship for execution of any electrical installation so as to obtain the cost of project is called electrical estimation and costing the key purpose of cost estimation is to give accurate information concerning the cost of project to its stakeholder and stakeholder may be the top management of project or the ultimate beneficiary of that project a sound and systematic cost estimation generate value added options that help project manager to minimize expenses on the project so it's basically a cost saving exercise now estimates are developed from the observation and knowledge of similar type of project executed previously so estimations are based on past experience and the accuracy of any estimate often depends upon the level of details of the project available and the amount of time devoted by project team on planning and analysis of project for estimation purpose there is definitely a difference between estimation and quotation a quote price denote the exact price that a client has to pay for any product or services whereas estimation gives an idea about the same cost so most often quotations are prepared only after estimation if a quotation is accepted then between supplier and beneficiary a contract is usually formed and now on acceptance of quotation the service provider is contractually bound to complete the work at the same price and beneficiary has to pay accordingly for the services provided on the other hand estimate is not a contractual bounding to any party it give an idea to form quotation and there may be a little difference between price and cost quoted and price and cost estimated so estimation is not a contractual bounding whereas quotation will become a contractual bounding between two parties there is a valid important question what is required to prepare a good estimate for an electrical work so these following requirements are necessary for preparing a good estimate for any electrical work the most important is drawing plan which have layout and position of all important points like main switch gear distribution boards control point for electrical points and position of electrical points now this drawing should contain the complete dimensions so that measurement can be made accordingly now plan layout also provide us complete electrical schedule for any rooms section how many points are there in a certain part of electrical installation that complete detail is called as electrical schedule now apart from that we must have a schematic electrical diagram of installation and wiring detail where size and number of wires required for electric connections should be mentioned and we must have a conduit layout tube diagram that suggest the pathway for wires so based on these available drawing we can make good estimation of electrical work now we need detailed technical specification about all material which is involved in electrical installation and the workmanship required for installation and execution of installation project and lastly we need schedule of rate for material and workmanship of existing conditions so that the standard schedule of rates are referred and proper adjustment are made as per local condition and time positions 
there exist number of purpose of electrical estimation and costing how some important purposes of electrical estimation and costing may be as follows now the one significant objective of estimation and costing is to obtain administrative approval for project or principal decision to go ahead on project execution in estimate we are certain the necessary amount of financial resources required on material and workmanship to complete the proposed electrical installation work in government and organized sector the administrative approval from top office wearer is necessary to initiate activity on any electrical installation project and that administrative approval of top officials depends on results of estimation and estimation results rough estimation results are used for arrangement and allocation of funds that required for that project and only after availability of fund and technical sanction a project can be initiated and executed for such approval estimation become a base for assessment of commercial value of that project after approval and financial section and financial sanction the second important purpose of electrical estimation is selection of electrical material and technology and workmanship for execution of electrical installation work in estimation we do rigorous planning and prepare design detail for electrical installation work that is used to select and decide the right material and appropriate technology for our electrical installation because the total cost of any electrical installation work ultimately depends upon cost of selected material and in present market wide range of material of different quality and cost values are available and we have to make an appropriate selection among all available material and that is a part of electrical estimation so as to make project as per scope definition within the budgetary planning after selecting the type of electrical items and workmanship the next part is required quantity of those material and workmanship has to be assessed and based on working drawing and the detail of specification the quantity and cost of material involved in project installations are calculated and volume of work that to be carried out in electrical installations to complete work are also work out it is also assessed that the material and quantity which we have picked is got what type of availability in market if it is ready available then there is no botheration but if we need order then we have to also consider the lead time that is required so that order can be made well before actual requirement of material on the project to execute any electrical installation we need manpower and different type of labor and official are required to execute electrical installation we may need electrical designer planner supervisor electrician wireman helpers and a team is formed of different category of people needed for electrical installation and required work day are calculated to find out cost of labor component in electrical installation the ultimate object of electrical estimation is to plan time and finance the detailed estimation can find out the completion time for the project and the fund required for that installation activity now based on type of material quantity and volume of work we can assess both completion time and financial requirement of any electrical installation project one important purpose of estimation is management of electrical installation project estimation is used to arrange and organize all sort of material manpower equipment tools necessary for the smooth execution of electric installations now all part of electrical installation project that is planning execution closure or the completion period cost of project all are based on estimation now the information of estimation is used to exercise monitoring and control over the quality and quantity of material and workmanship that is required in installation work suppose a project is initiated without proper estimation then it become very difficult to arrange the right type of material in the right quantity at the right time so this will geo part all three part of project management it will reduce quality and scope of project 
the cost of project may increase and time to complete project may also go beyond the scheduled limit so a good estimation work can improve quality of project and reduce its cost and time as estimation can suggest the most economical processor for execution of electrical installation work another purpose of estimation is final cost calculation in estimation we measure quantity of all material and workmanship and also consider rate of those material and manpower services and calculate the total amount of cost involved in all type of material and all type of works but apart from that estimation also fix up the cost of various other components such as overhead cost supervisory or inspection charges transportation and incidental or contingency cost components and that all summation will give final cost calculation of entire project with this calculation estimation provide a idea about the entire cost of the job and one can calculate the feasibility of that project execution and top management can decide whether that electric installation project would be included in organization list according to the availability of fund with the organization so this final cost calculation gives a clear picture about business idea of any project considering the fund available with the organization The ultimate object of estimation is to invite tender or quotation for electrical installation work. The estimation is prepared by one department and that invite tender or quotation from other contractor and suppliers and compare the quoted rates with the estimated amount and with that comparison both quality of material to be supplied and workmanship to be performed can be checked and rates can be compared to finalize contractors to supply and execute the electrical installation work based on quality rates and work items many a times estimates are also used to prepare bill of material for supplier and contractors so estimate is a valuable base on which rates of execution of work is decided another objective of estimation is valuation for a existing electrical installation if we make estimation of entire work then we can find out the valuation of that existing electrical installation many a times estimate documents are used as reference for future work and become basis for further planning and decision making in future projects we hope this small learning video has explained what is estimation in electrical installation and it has also explained the various purposes of electrical estimation our other learning video of the same playlist are equally useful and you can share them with your friends too and if you need exam centric professional notes of this subject do join the membership of our channel happy learning have nice time thank you very much